Brigand's Law is a rapid fire sidearm that allows you to take down enemies very, very quickly. And this one has been introduced in Season of Plunder. Well, today I'm going to have a closer look at the stats and the perks and the god rolls to chase for PvE and PvP. Plus, also have a look at how to get Brigand's Law in Destiny 2. Well, if you're new around here or find this useful, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below for all the latest Destiny 2 content and turn on notifications by hitting that bell. And roughly 98% of viewers who watch this week in video games aren't subscribed. So subscribe today and never miss an update. Well, first of all, let's have a look at how to get Brigand's Law. Well, to get this one, you have to own Season of Plunder and take part in seasonal activities like Catch Crash and Expeditions. So Brigand's Law is a potential reward for these activities. And you can also focus Umbral Engrabs at the helm via the Star Chart to get Brigand's Law. Although, you'll need to upgrade the Star Chart first. Well, the weapon is also craftable, but you need to collect a number of red bordered weapons first and level them up before it can be crafted. Well, let's have a closer look at Brigand's Law. So it's a legendary energy sidearm with a rapid fire frame, meaning the weapon fires in full auto mode, and you've got deeper ammo reserves and slightly faster reload when the magazine is empty. Look at the stats, got 35 for impact, 20 for range, 63 for stability. 51 for handling, 41 for reload speed, it's a 450 rounds per minute sidearm with 15 in the magazine. Well, Brigand's Law does have a smaller magazine than most sidearms, but the rapid fire frame nature of the weapon does make it a viable choice in both PvE and also PvP. Ideally, you don't want to be too far from your target when you pull the trigger, as this thing really lets rip with its bullets, taking down enemies with a quick time to kill for a sidearm. This one also comes with the origin trait right hook, where dealing melee damage gives the weapon increased target acquisition and range for a short period of time, so that's good with a sidearm, and dealing melee damage again extends that effect. Well, next up, let's have a look at the Brigand's Law God Roll Guide. So for PvE, Corkscrew Rifling, Tactical Mag, Feeding Frenzy, and Surrounded would be a decent roll. For Corkscrew Rifling, slightly increase the range of stability and slightly increase the handling speed. Then you've got Tactical Mag, so slightly increased stability, increased reload speed, and slightly increases magazine size. Then you've got Feeding Frenzy, so each rapid kill with a weapon progressively increases the reload speed for a short time. Then you've got Surrounded, and the weapon gains bonus damage when three or more enemies are in close proximity. For PvP, on the other hand, Arrowhead Break, Akrai's Round, Pugilist, and Vault Shot would be good. So with Arrowhead Break, greatly controls recoil and increases the handling speed. Akrai's Rounds increases range. Pugilist, so final blows of the weapon generate melee energy and dealing melee damage briefly improves the weapon's handling. Then you've got Vault Shot, so reloading the weapon after feeding a target, overcharge the weapon for a short period of time, causing it to jolt on its next hit. Well, let me know in the comments what you think of Brigand's Law, and also let me know your favourite roles. Well, that is it for this guide for how to get Brigand's Law in Destiny 2, and as always, thank you so much for watching or listening. For more Destiny 2 content like this, Hit that subscribe button down below and subscribe to This Week in Video Games. Or you can check me out on Twitter at TWIVG Podcast. If you enjoyed this video, found it useful, liking and sharing the video would really help me out. Otherwise, check out the other videos on the channel. Thanks again, and I'll see you soon.